Hello everybody and welcome to the One Man Renegade Podcast YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Honorable Greg B, and today we're doing something, I don't know, a little bit different, I guess. Um, so, this is the 1995 Classic Basketball Rookies Box. Um, so what this basically is, is of all the rookies that kind of were coming out of college, um, they, uh, you know, they... You know, it's 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 a college product. It was before they were in the pros. So I mean, we got Rasheed Wallace on the back here. We got uh, Corl Corliss Williamson. Um, we got Jerry Stackhouse at the front. Uh, but the, but then there's like the Shack card with him and Alonzo Mourning, and they're like clearly in their uh, pro jerseys. So I'm a bit confused by that uh, as what what that card's all about because I just assumed this was all like college or guys coming out of college um in their college uniforms but obviously 1995 the big big uh rookie was coming was not out of college though was out of high school kevin garnett so i guess maybe they have high school cards in here too i'm i'm, I'm a bit confused by that all that but um um so it definitely has collegiate here in the back but any event uh yeah so we're looking for stackhouse rasheed wallace um and is that Antonio McDice there? Uh, trying to think else. Who else was in this? Uh, Michael Finley, I believe, was this year. So yeah, some rookies from this year. But there's also one autograph card guaranteed in every box, which is kind of crazy because I can't remember any product prior to this having a guaranteed autograph in the pack. And this is 1995 we're talking about. Um, you know, I, I kind of remember in the mid 2000s, you know, boxes starting to guarantee, you know, like a hit, not necessarily an autograph, but a hit. Um, but then, you know, some other, some higher end stuff would definitely guarantee autographs. But I mean, yeah, I mean, th there's potentially decent autographs in here, so we'll, we'll have to find out. But there's also a bunch of other, uh, uh, foil, there's a bunch of foil stuff. There's a bunch of inserts and stuff too. So let's dive into it. There's, I want to say 36 packs uh 10 cards per pack so we'll do a stack a day uh for the next four weeks until we're done with this um but yeah interesting product it's you know it's not the normal stuff i you know i usually like to stick to the major league stuff but some of the basketball stuff's hard to find and the 95 just anything with kevin garnett in it's tough it's expensive so i kind of went with something that was a little less expensive all right so they made this difficult for me <laughs> There's three stacks of 12 instead of four stacks of nine, but uh, we're still going to do just nine. Uh, let's see. Eight and nine. We're going to do nine stacks. But before we get that started, um, if you haven't already, if you're new to the channel or you just haven't, go down down, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also, hit the thumbs up, hit the like, hit the share. Um, and head on down in the comments. Let me know what you think of these products. Uh, if you ever opened any of these classic products from back in the day, uh, what do you think of them? Or just maybe 1995 basketball in general? Or the draft class or something? I don't know. Whatever you want to talk about. Also, links. There's my podcast, my blog, and all my other social media. So let's dive in, shall we? Uh, let's take a look at the pack real quick. If this says anything of any significance. Um... Rookie Redemption Program, that, that'll that be cool. But there are some odds. This is tough to read. Um, Pro Line Series 2 preview cards. There's a bunch of silver foil, one per pack. I don't know, you can read all that. Um, if you want them. It's tough to read. All right, let's see what we got here. Can't say I ever opened any of these cards before, or even seen any of them. But we got David Vaughn. Uh, PD Sessions. Uh, here's the back of the card. Con Constantine Popa. Kind of tough to read. They kind of blend in with the background. Dan Cross. And there we go. We got Kevin Garnett. Um, in his... Oh, USA jersey. That's interesting. Um, hmm. Okay. There we go. Kevin Garnett. First first pack. We got it. Uh, then we got uh, James Scott. This seems to be some sort of foily card. I don't know exactly what that's all about, but... Maybe that's that silver. I thought it said there was a. I don't know. Uh, Chris. Uh, no. Carolyn Warley. Uh, we got the Jerry Stackhouse Wooden Award contender. 
followed up by George Banks and uh, Checklist. With Jerry Stackhouse on it, though. Okay, that's cool. All right, yeah, interesting cards. Um, I guess that silvery one was... I thought there was... What, what did it say the cards were? Silver Foil Signature Series, but... So I thought it had a signature on it, but I guess it's just the foil. All right. James Scott. We got Greg Ostertag. Um, these aren't sticking together, which is good. We got Randolph Childress, Ronnie McMahon, uh, Ian. No, sorry. Tom Kleischmitz, uh Hallmark Gold Crown Shack card. O okay. That. I don't know if this is an ad or if this is an actual card. This is weird. But anyways, it's a shack, so it might be might be worth something. We got Akeem Olajuwon. Uh, Centers of Attention card. That's interesting. Yeah, see how they... Yeah, they kind of... They don't have the NBA license, so they do what Panini does with baseball and kind of like photoshopped it out of there. Uh, then we got Glenn Wisby. Brent Berry. Uh, Devin Gray, and then we got Rashid Wallace, uh, Wooden Award uh, Contenders. All right, moving on. We got Mark Davis, Jerry Stackhouse, uh, Wooden Award uh, Contender, Gary Trent, Katibo uh, Mobley, uh, Bob Sura. It's uh, some sort of snapshot. I don't think it's an insert. I think it's just a subset. Then we got uh, the foil card is Donnie Marshall. We got Arthur Agge, Aggie. I don't know how to say it. Eddie Jones. Randy Rutherford. And a wooden award of Randolph Childress. Uh, wooden award contender. All right. So these are cool cards, I guess. I mean, I wish it was easier to read the names. I'll be honest. It's kind of... Annoying. Carlin War War Warley, Jerry Stackhouse, a Warden Award uh, contender again. George Banks, uh, Jerry Stackhouse checklist again. We got Julius Mikalik. See, now why is this? Oh, this is our autograph. Oh, man. Julius Mikalik. Ugh. Yeah. Oh, well, <laughs> that's not the name I was looking for, certainly. Uh, there's, like, Jason Kidd and Shaq rookies and stuff, but uh, I have no idea who this guy is. And <laughs> there you go, there's our autograph. I mean, I guess that's why it wasn't really a big deal to get an autograph back in those days. You get someone like that, some <laughs> some autograph like that. Uh, Eric Meek is our foil card. Uh, we got David Vaughn, PD Sessions, uh, Constantine Popa. And Dan Cross again. Went to high school with a Dan Cross. Oh, well. And there we go. There's the this guy again. But uh, Julius Mikalak. 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 Uh, but it's the uh, regular version of the card. Hakeem Olajuwon. Uh, that's cool. Corliss Williamson won an award. Why is this all weird? I don't know if that's just a, if that's something... Is that just a misprinter? I don't know what's going on with that card. Michael Evans, uh, Glenn Robinson, all rookies. A foil card is uh, Andrew DeClerc. We got Joe Smith, Eric Williams, Bob Shura, and Lawrence Moten, Wooden Award. Uh, Dealy. All right, next up we got Troy uh, Brown, David Vaughn, Petey Sessions, Constantine Popa, Dan Cross, our full card is Russell Larson. Then we got Lance Hughes, Roderick Anderson, Rashid Wallace, uh, and uh, Jawan Howard. All rookies card. Interesting. All right, next up, we got uh, Corliss Williamson, the not messed up version, <laughs> Michael Evans, uh, Chris Robinson. No, Glenn Robinson, excuse me. Can't read these cards. Uh, Donald Williams, uh, Jamal Palkiner. Our foil card is 
uh, Dragon Tarlac. Sounds like something out of Game of Thrones. <laughs> Lou Rowe from UMass. I remember Lou Rowe. There he is, Lou Rowe. Uh, then we got uh, Laren, Lauren Meyer, Junior Burrow, Russell Larson. All right, a couple more packs to go. I'll move on next week to more packs. Uh, we got PD Sessions again, Constantine Popa, Dan Cross, uh, Kevin Garnett, again, Anthony Gillespie, our full card is Jason Kidd, then we got Dave, Dan Reed, and Andrew LeClerc, Dragon Tar Tarlac, and John Amici, and our last pack, and again, please subscribe, like, share, notification bell, uh, Travis Best. Uh, Donnie Boyk, uh, yeah, uh, Ed O'Bannon. Oh, Ed O'Bannon is an interesting one because, uh, it was around this time that he was, uh, in, uh, like the NBA or the NCAA, like, basketball game that EA Sports put out, and like it was, it had like their likenesses like their numbers and it was supposed to kind of be them but obviously they couldn't use their names because of rules and then he sued them and all sorts of nonsense happened uh we got troy brown but not the not the bat not the what am i trying to say not the uh football player rebecca lobo pointers proof nine one of 949 okay that's interesting our full card is devin gray um, uh, Sean Respert, then we got Eric Meek, Mario Bennett, and rounding things off with Reggie, Reggie Jackson, but not that Reggie Jackson, but not even that other Reggie Jackson, a totally different Reggie Jackson. Uh, but yeah, Ed O'Bannon kind of ruined, uh, sports, uh, college sports games for everyone, or he was a part of a group, he was one of, like, the leaders of the group that kind of ruined everything, but, like, years later, like, almost 20 years later after he was out of college he's like wait a minute i never got compensated and my name and stuff is in that game it's kind of a weird situation but um that's why i don't make college uh they don't make college sports games anymore for uh uh video games i should say and like some of the old, some of the ones in that last year are like super valuable i saw like two that like 2014 NCAA football for like the PlayStation 3 is like 150 bucks or something crazy. But anyways, thank you everyone for watching. I come back next week. We'll do another uh, another nine packs of this. Uh, unfortunately, we already got our autographed and it wasn't anything wasn't anything great. But maybe we'll get lucky and maybe there'll be an extra autograph in here. But there's definitely some more like parallels and stuff. So hopefully, they can grab a Kevin Garnett cool kevin garnett parallel or something like that um, but anyways thank you everyone for watching come back tomorrow for more videos come back next week for more of this and come back every day every day and subscribe like share links all that stuff thank you for watching goodbye